read a lot of emotion after the, the Marshawn hit. Do you feel like your team responded in a way that was acceptable to you to that and, and, and managed that emotion in the right way from that point forward? Yeah, it's tough. You, you know, you, you see a guy get hit like that. But uh, I thought they they did respond the right way. I thought they played extremely hard again tonight. You know, we're right there. or shot away. You know, and we have the puck on our stick there. It's unfortunate we give it away there at the end, but that's how it goes. It was almost, it seemed to be helpful in terms of getting your team to that level that maybe you need to have them at to play against a heavy team like that. Do you agree or not? Yeah, they're, these guys, they don't quit. They just keep coming. They... Uh, <laughs> They've been doing this for a long time here. And I, I know we've lost a string of games here. We've had some really good games in here, and we're close. It's, it's not like we're, we're miles away and not, not in these games. We're right there. The, both these games, last one's 5-2, but it's 2-2 late. They score, they get it on the power play, and then they get two empty netters tonight. We're right there again, 2-2, um, going to overtime. You know, you go right back to the Winnipeg, Minnesota games, like real heavy teams, good hockey teams that we're playing head-to-head. -head. So. Hey, you know, I feel for the guys because they're they're pouring it out, and and uh, you know it'd be nice for them to get the result tonight. Brad, nobody wants to see their their player down and in that position as Peak was. Was your issue with officials was it that the play wasn't called dead because of a penalty elbowing, or that it wasn't blown dead because of an injured, clearly injured player? Yeah, you know, I, I'm just gonna not comment on it because I'll I'll probably get myself in trouble and I don't want to. So. Um, yeah, it's hard to see uh, one of your guys down. I'll leave it at that. And you would have learned first intermission that he was okay. Mm -hmm. uh, just your pleasant, I guess, surprise to see him back up. Oh, yeah. Quickly. Yeah, I think we dodged a bullet there. Um, you know, he uh, he responded well, came back, was able to play. So, uh, you know, knock on wood here, he's good for tomorrow. But uh, that's a gutsy effort to come back, and he played a hard game. And this is pro probably not a game a uh, tough game for Carson Meyer to debut with all of the four on four, four on three. Yeah, yeah I, I lost time. those guys. Yeah, it, it's, and it wasn't uh, a product of their not playing. You, that, that I just said, this is a messed up game as far as the four on fours, four on threes. I'm looking across. I got Jake in there for 10 minutes and Bjorky, and we're getting power plays. And so it was, it was really um, a, a different kind of game. And so you lost, I lost them. And it's, it's hard. I've been in those, those skates before and, you seize up almost, so you just you roll with your three. And I thought the the three lines were going pretty good. Um, made one minor change, but other than that, I thought they were rolling. So we just went with that. You know, I know they were shorthanded too. They lost some guys there during the game, and so it was just kind of one of those games. Will Meyer go to the league? He will. <laughs>